Previously on Pokemon Randomizer Cage Lock, the boys took on the Canelave City Gym and its leader, then began their sixth cage match. Houdini sent in Venomoth and Tom sent in Grand Bull. It was a very close match but in the end Tom was able to get the W. Now he only needs one more win to ensure a final fight. Will Tom make the comeback of the century, or is Houdini's domination inevitable? Well, you'll just have to keep watching the series to find out. Hey guys, this is Tom Leo signing in. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Diamond and Pearl Randomizer Cage Lock with my partner, your boy, Houdini. How are you doing, my man? I'm doing uh, pretty good. I uh, just had a nice little breakfast and uh, ready to record my my rival over here, Mr. Tom Leo. Uh, thank you for, thanks for asking. <laughs> Anytime. Uh, so today, uh, we uh, are heading over to Lake Verity because we got... Uh, because we got to deal with that crap over there, and then we are headed to Snowpoint and uh, taking on the next gym leader. But first, uh, uh, quite a bit has happened in between episodes. Um, but first, I want to do a quick team recap, starting with this beauty right here, uh, which is my new Pidgeot. Uh, okay. Now this might be a little confusing, but basically what happened in between this episode and the last episode, I went around uh, previous locations, see if there was any items I missed, and I found two new fossils. One of them had a Pidgeotto. So, we, uh, so I discussed this with Houdini, saying that this Pidgeot is legal to have since it was a new static uh, fossil. So uh, I decided I'm going to put this Pokemon on the team for the time being. I nicknamed it AJC2 uh, to, you know, to bring AJC back. Um, but this one, just like the previous one, has the dry skin ability. And it has the moves Sand Attack, Wing Attack, Quick Attack, and Fly. Then we got Crunch, the Carnivine, with the Soundproof ability. It has the moves Faint Attack, Crunch, Vine Whip, and Ring Out. Uh, then we got Oscar the Charizard with the Solid Rock ability, super helpful, uh, with the moves Slash, Air Slash, Dragon Range, and Flamethrower. Then we got Whiskers the Whizcash with the Steadfast ability, and has the moves Rest, Magnitude, Surf, and Zen Headbutt. I'm hoping to teach it Earthquake at some point. Uh, might happen in this episode, who knows. Then we got Pug uh, the Gramble with the Hyper Cutter ability. It has the moves Thunderfang, Bite, Strength, and Headbutt. And finally, I decided to put uh, Frank, my Ariados, on the team. Um, it has the moves Swift Swim, Sucker Punch, Bug Bite, Pin Missile, and Shadow Sneak. Now, there are a couple of other things that I do need to let you know what happened. So, the other fossil that I, um, that I got was a Golbat. And I took the time to train up this Golbat, and it is... And it has evolved into another Crobat, as you can see here. I nicknamed it Jam 2. And uh, like I said, this Crobat is completely legal. Um, and if this Crobat, and if this first Crobat dies for whatever reason, then uh, then I'm perfectly allowed to use this one. And uh, lastly, uh, my Piloswine evolved into a Mamoswine. Uh, I just had to teach it Ancient Power by giving, by uh, teaching it via Heart Scale Guy. And uh, this tank is is looking pretty solid, but yeah, that's what I'm rocking with right now. I know that was a little long, but uh, I, these are important things that uh, I just had to explain. But I'm gonna let Houdini take over with his team recap. So go ahead. All right, starting off, we got the Heracross, the Amrit, with a battle armor ability with close combat, aerial ace, horn attack, brick break. You already know. Uh, Rice is on the squad, the Zapdos with Thundershock, Charge, Ancient Power, and Pluck with the Solid Rock ability. Moving on, we got Charlie the Blaze Kid with the Suction Cups ability with Bulk Up, Double Kick, Slash, and Blaze Kick. Moving on, we got Mitchell the Dusnor with the moves Shadow Punch, Will-O-Wisp, Confuse Ray, and Shadow Sneak with the Dry Skin ability. Next up, we got Jam the Legendary Suicune with Water Absorb with Bite, Aurora Beam, Surf, and Rain Dance. Next up, we got Slack King Mrs. Beast with Yawn, Strength, Slack Off, and Faint Attack with the Sniper ability. Now, I too, I went to the same areas that uh, Tom went and I did not get any fossils. However, I did evolve a Pokemon 
and that Pokemon was our Pillow Swine. It was the uh, egg, I believe, wasn't? Yeah, I believe it was the egg. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, you got from Riley. And, uh, yeah. From Riley, and uh, we have Napier, um, and it has the adaptability um, ability. That sounds like adaptability ability. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, it has the moves Earthquake, Hail, Takedown, and Ice Fang. And um, I was kind of conf- torn of if I should put it on the team or not. And I decided not to. Nothing against Mammoth Swan. I just feel like the team I have now gives me the coverage that I really need at this point. Hmm. That's. And I don't want to lose anything from the, uh, taking somebody off putting Mammoth Swan on. So I hmm. think I'm okay right now. So it's kind of like I have a seventh member of the team. But Mammoth Swan's kind of just sitting out for like right now. Not just saying not, not saying he couldn't be on the team because he easily could. But I'm just happy with what I have now. Yeah, that's the same. That's the same for me right now. Like I feel like we we've, we've got some really good mons, but it's so hard to choose which one should take up your team because you can only have six at a time. Yeah. So should we start heading towards the? Uh, I'm already at. I'm already at the lake. I'm outside. Uh, oh. So where are you right now? Uh, getting knocked out. <laughs> uh, and then I will fly to, uh... Okay. My phone is ringing. I ain't got time for this garbage. What's going on? I, my phone is currently ringing. Just says I'm on hold. Ignore that. Uh, Are you there? Um... Uh, yeah, my, my, uh, phone was ringing. Oh, okay. I was like, I see, uh, I was on hold. I, it was said I was on hold. I was like, what the heck's going on? Yeah, I, uh... My phone started ringing. I didn't recognize the number, so I just went, beep, reject. Okay. Um, kind of scared me, not gonna lie. Um, but okay, I am in Twin Leaf Town. Probably another one of those. 201. So if you want to start going in, you can. Yep, headed in right now. Hey, Professor. Okay. I'm hitting the wrong button. Uh. Who's on? Who's up front right now? Okay, this should be a good. This should be good enough. Air cross. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Double battle. Blah 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 blah. Let's just get this over oh. with. Get these uh, battles. Ow! Two grass types. That's awesome. All right, so I'm fighting a Steelix and a Slacking. <laughs> uh, you better hope that Steelix doesn't kill your Pokemon. I'm gonna just uh, close. I'm not gonna close combat. I'm going to. I gotta get rid of that Slacking. Um. Did he kill? No, no. I almost picked the wrong move. Oh my God, Slacking is so bulky, and he's dead. That's my man Heracross does not play these games. Oh, you had Heracross Rock out. Rock misses. Um, All right. Let's go for Plug, I guess. Uh, Pug, you get in here. Switch in with the Carnivine. Okay, it's just this Pokemon that's left, right? Uh, doesn't have anything else? Yeah, I think so. so. First I will battle too. Oh, wait, no. He's got two. Never mind. I lied to you. Yeah, there's a lot of. For a second. Ah, another. Wow, this person had a whole bunch of different grass types and one flying type. That's it. That's hilarious. Electrode. Oh, I hate this thing. Like screw electrode. Like actually screw electrode. All right, I'm just about. Uh, I'm just. Get, I'm just about over there. I just got a couple more uh, galactic grunts to fight. Same. I got these two and then I'm, I'm looking at Dawn. Yep, but. I can see her over there. Oh shoot. Oh, Parasect, okay. Huh. This Parasect has uh, the Drizzle ability. So now there's a Labrys. <laughs> there's a Labrys. <laughs> you don't sound too thrilled about that. I've ran into Tyranitar already, a Lapras, a Steelix, a Slack King. I've ran into power really quick here. This guy's using double slap. Stop touching. Scorpy, how are the kids? Anorith, that's a rock type, I believe. I'm gonna switch. Is Scorpy a bug Pokemon or is he just poison? Scorpy is a bug poison type. But okay, but when okay. he transforms into a Drapion, he's like he loses the bug dark aspect and, and replaces dark. Yeah. Which is that always that always confused me. Like, why would it not be a bug type? It looks like a bug type. I don't know. Don't know. Anyways, uh, so I just finished with the Team Galactic guys. I'm gonna run. Who's I'm gonna that? run back to Twin Leaf Town to heal up because I want to be prepared. You know, as Scar says, okay. be prepared. I just I had to throw that in. 
I, I, I was reading dialogue. I'm battling uh, the, uh, the commander, admin, I guess, if you want to call it. Is it an admin? Yeah. Well, they're the they're the commanders, technically. I don't know yeah. what... I don't really know what makes... Alright, this commander pissed me off last time I fought her. Dumb slack king. I hope she doesn't have it again. Okay, starting off with a fampy. I can handle that. Okay. Fanfy. Hey, remember when I, I had a Dawn fan? Fanfy. Yeah. Remember when I had a Dawn fan? That was pretty cool. Yeah. Meg. I'm so glad you don't. I think that thing scared me mm, so much. I think that was Meg Mortar. Yeah. Okay, I made the right play. Blossom. Since Blossom eats my blaze kick. Nope. Vespa oh, Quinn. Wow. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Stupid this thing is end, gone. Dog. <laughs> That's the second phone call. We've never had this problem. And here we are with the second phone call in this episode. Oh, I almost killed it with one fly attack. That's, I'll finish it off with a quick attack. I I missed using AJC. He, he really carried the team for a while there. Die, cele I almost call it celebrity. Celebi. <laughs> <laughs> celebrity Celebi. Celebrity Celebi. Uh, All right, I finished. Uh, so now what we got to do is head over to uh, Snow Point, get her a gym, but we, but mainly also to check up on uh, our our rival who went over to Lake Acuity. Yeah, it's called Lake Acuity. Um, so if I'm yep. not mistaken, we need we need both strength and rock smash in order to get through. I already got one in. I already got strength on uh, Gramble. Uh, I just need rock smash, which I can get from my Riolu. So this will not be an official team change. I'm just putting. But now, I'm gonna switch Riolu. What part of Mount Cornet do we have to go through? Um, I believe... Is it Celestic Town? Either Celestic oh, Town or, uh... Eterna City should get us where we need to go. Oh, we'll just, I'll try to select Celestic Town. Yeah, that's where I'm at right now. Okay, I'm gonna um, get the Pokemon I need. I have to go grab my Gligar, my useless Gligar. <laughs> Even, it's not really my Pokemon, I just use it for an HM Slave. I wasn't gonna waste Rock Smash on somebody. Mm-hmm. Uh, who should I replace? I guess I'll just replace Dustnor. Ooh, when you walk, when you walk in, there's a the stone across from you has a hidden item. I just got a black flute. Not really sure what that does, but it sounds awesome. Hang on, let me think. So I need someone with strength as well. Uh, who's got strength on my squad? Who indeed? Slack. So I'm gonna grab my slacking. Oh damn, slacking! With no true haunt ability. Um, it's nice. With strength, that's a deadly combination. It's just nice. It's a nice little combination. Now you pack. Hey, little girl! Get out of my way! Alright, so, uh, uh, just to reiterate for everyone, we had an encounter, a Mount Coronet encounter a few episodes back, so whatever Pokemon we encounter here will not count. So, uh, I'm just uh, not gonna bother with these Pokemon. Oh, um, wait a minute. I just remembered. I got a whole bunch of max repels I can use. I bought some a little bit ago, too. Glad you said that. See, I'm getting smarter. First, I remember to use the... What's it called? The... The quick ball. And now I'm, uh... Yeah. <laughs> Scrolling down, looking at all these items. It's going down for real. Da 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 Find an X attack. Yeah, that's not really going to help me, I don't think. All right, Max. All right, slacking. So we're going straight north, right? Yeah. Yep. Head exactly up. Ah, damn it. There's an area with. There's an area of fog in here for whatever reason. Really? Yeah. This is going to. Sucks. I know, it's freaking annoying. Well, luckily... Mystic Water. Well, we luckily we won't need to run into Pokemon because we got, uh... We got our, uh, Max Repels. There's a few items yeah, we can fossil. get here. Heat Rock. That's for... Hey, I got a fossil! A new a one? Fossil. I think I've already had this one. Okay. 
We can we can check off camera, but uh, if that's a new fossil, oh, yeah. you could totally you could totally keep it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm kind of wandering around, just trying to figure out where I need to be. Oh, do you have? Wait, we don't. Uh, I was about to ask, do you have escape ropes? But I don't think we will really need them right now. Expert belt. Okay, not bad. Okay, repel effects wore off. I don't know if it was in later in later games, but I really wish they would ask you if you'd like to split, uh, spray another repel, so you wouldn't have to go back into your right. Bag. Yes, yes. This was always annoying. Another quick clock. Probably gonna be way ahead of me because I am exploring this area. Uh, for items and stuff. Yeah, same here. It's honestly not that hard to map out where everything's at. Another berry, cool. Okay, up. All right, it's just for that one room that has a uh, defog, so we're good in that regard. All right, I am in Route 216. This is a brand new route, yes. so I can get a new yeah, encounter here. Heavy. Holy, I'm. Why am I so nervous than I was during the the other times I've been catching Pokemon? Like, yeah. this makes me nervous. Found another plate. What do you know? <laughs> I found an iron plate. I'm the king of finding these things, man. I found an iron plate not too long ago. I'm just exploring this water, man. You just never know what you're gonna find. All right, repel effects wore off. Oh yeah, the repel is still. Off. I was like, another iron plate. What in the hell? What are the odds? What are the flipping odds? So, did you have to go up those stairs all the way at the end, or did you have to go somewhere else? Uh, both ways work, but there's only one trainer to the, uh, up top, so... If you want to fight someone. Alright, here's my encounter. Um, you are way ahead of me. <laughs> are you kidding me? Oh, my Just... chest. Why is my chest hurt right now? I mean, I guess, uh... If I get this leveled up, this will be... Kind of zinc. Dude, I can't. <laughs> Guess what I got Bro. as my encounter for this route? Pidge Pidgeot! Pidgeot! You got a Pidgeot for this route? No, I'm just saying that was my guess. Oh, <laughs> no, 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 it's not a Pidgeot. Okay, then what is it? It's a Magikarp. That's a potential Gyarados. Yeah, I know. Like, I just need to get it uh, up a level and it'll, it'll evolve. All right, um, I'm gonna check to see if uh, I don't think I have any more names, but I'll I'm gonna check just to make sure. Snow, there's snow. Yeah, that's how far behind I am. I just got outside. <laughs> uh, da, 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 I think yeah, yeah. I'm out of comments or yeah, I'm out of I'm out of different I'm out of new names, so I gotta come up with something new. All right, here's my encounter. Maybe if I can find something in the grass. Ah, here it is. Please be something decent. Oh. <gasps> Yay! Sounds like it's a swamper. <laughs> oh damn, that's actually power. Uh huh. You, you still gotta catch it though. Yep. Here we go. Quick ball. <laughs> nope. I spelled this completely wrong. Wow, that didn't work. Okay. Um, Some Pokemon are a lot harder to catch in, uh, with Quick Balls. So, uh, I'm gonna nickname this Magikarp Sushi. Because why the hell not? Hey, man. I'm down with it. Alright, um, now I gotta figure out if I wanna battle trainers. So, I'm probably going to lose Swampert, to be honest. Oh, really? What's wrong? Oh, never mind. I caught it. <laughs> Because I thought the hail was going to kill it. It was in the red. And, um... Nine tails. I'm not scared about that. I'm going to name this guy... I'm naming it Derpy. Or Derp. Your name's Swamper Derpy? Derp. No, his name is Derp. I'm a, I have amazing nicknames. Like, no one can touch my nicknames. <laughs> okay, 
air cross, get in the back. I don't need you to battle anymore. I got the swamper. So, in the marsh back. Chomp. That's gonna. Oh, not marsh chomp, a swamper. All right. So the. So I don't know if you know this, but the house you go to, the first house you see on this route, you can sleep in the bed and uh, get your Pokemon healed. That's nice. Um. Yeah, which is the what? only bed that I've seen that you can actually walk up to the bed and sleep in it. Thundershock! And you still didn't kill him. <laughs> I'm finding another trainer, and this guy has a Kingler. This 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 hail is actually gonna be a problem. Yeah, this hail can be pretty annoying. Mm -hmm. I mean, Mammal Swine probably would be in the mood to bring along. <laughs> Cause uh, he doesn't get affected by it. Remember? Yes, yes, that would have made more sense. Oh, really, Aladios? You gotta be kidding me. I've been there before. <laughs> Flashback to that episode. Aladios. Aladios. <laughs> Adioses and Ladioses. Ladioses. Whatever. War Turtle to start out. Bring it in. Dude, this hail is. Ugh. We're probably around like a 20 minute mark because I didn't start the timer for like two minutes. So we're probably about the 20 minute mark. Mine says 18, so we're about the 20 minute mark. Okay. Um, Ratata. Finally. Yeah, how close is that? How close is that bed? Just, uh, just curiosity. Like it's just that the just before the the trail turns upwards, the house will be right there. Okay. Well, I'm gonna need that. <laughs> this Ratata almost killed me. Ta -ta -ta. Need to. Okay. I'm on Suicune. Dude, every one of my Pokemon are like in the yellow. Ooh, ouch. That's that's scary. Mm. Mm, like very. Like I know I know I'm against you in this series, but I'm scared for you. Uh-huh. And one of my Pokemon I have are uh, a little useless. Gligar. Slugma, that's a fire type. Pug, you should be able to handle this, no problem. Uh, here we go. I'm pretty sure this is Glue. why there's a house here. I don't know if I can one shot you, but. And I can't. What are you fighting? A gloom. Oh, gloom. I thought you said glue for some reason. I was like, what? Nah. <laughs> fighting glue. <laughs> Alright, a nummel. I can take a nummel. Surf's up. Not sure exactly how many trainers. Hey, swine up. That's cute. What else could I have? I could have had an Empoleon. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. Machiato. I think Machiato is a fighting type or something. AJ, get the in there. A little yellow dude? Yep. Yeah, he's fighting. He's the evolved form of Hariyama. Yeah. In the pre evolution of Hariyama. Yeah. Okay, who's the last one? <sighs> Skip Bloom. I ain't scared of him one bit. Yo, where's this house at? <gasps> found the house. I'm glad you found the house. I need to heal. Um, so if I'm not mistaken, the yep, this is a new area, the one with a huge blizzard storm. So I could get another encounter here, or we both can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we gonna have so time? You can heal. Are are we gonna have time in this episode? Well, we're at 22 minutes. Wilmer, um, um, we we might just have to heal, like either stop back at the house and just kind of make our way back forward again, or I don't know. Well, there's like, okay, so there's like there are trainers in this area, but they're in like different places, and some of them you can't even see. Yeah. So what should we maybe just go straight to the straight to the patch area, get our new encounter, and then uh, head to snow points and call it an episode? You mean you can? If you want to do the trainers behind the scenes, kind of, I'm cool with that. Cause I'm going, I'm gonna try to get all, like I want to get all the experience I can get. Sure, like, I'm, I'm, I'm already at, I'm already at a decently high level as it is. Oh, I could have had Tentacool. Damn it, I like Tentacool. There's another house here. No bed though. I bet he gives you, like, rock climb. I think that one gives you rock climb. Nope, he doesn't. Oh! Oh. Rock climb is outside the house, though. 
Excellent. I knew I was close. I was close. Yeah, I, I... I'm actually surprised I remembered that. Yeah, so am I. Um, who on my team can learn rock climb? Is there anyone in particular? Probably Hariyama. Rock climb. Let's see. I'm going to boot this up. Uh, my pug is able to learn rock climb. Is it stronger Rainbow. than headbutt? It's pretty close. Let's see. Headbutt is I think, 70. I, I think physical. rock climb is 80, and I think headbutt 70. Headbutt 70. Rock climb is 90. Ooh. Yeah. A charging attack that may also leave the foe confused. That's actually clean. I might get rid of headbutt. I mean, it's got 85% accuracy, but I think it's worth it. Yeah, but 85, man. Mm. I'm finding a whale lord. I think it'll be worth it. I'm finding a whale lord. Pug, you are learning rock climb. I am biting this whale. And it's asleep. <laughs> Alright. Oh, there's another <sighs> house here. Oh, fine. You want to throw out your beast? I'll throw out my beast. Let's go. Let's go, Slacking. Yeah. Yeah. Strength time. Mm. Yeah. Hey, if you go into the... If you go into the house that, uh... That... That's, uh, just outside the grass. Oh, wait. That's just a different grass area. Okay, there's, like, a grass area with a ice stone around it. By that house, there's a, uh, there's a person who gives you a spell tag. Or a completely randomized item, I'm not sure. All I know is I'm fighting Rampardos, and I almost died. That would have been... What almost died? My sweet kid. Oh, oh my god, that was so risky. Okay. Sweet kid would have died. Oh yeah, yeah, get you off the Magnemite, okay. Alright, Rock Climb. Oh, that is solid. That is solid. Rock climb is so solid. Uh, us. Oh shoot, Pug can't be switched. You gotta be kidding me. Does Rapid Dash seriously have Arena Trap? Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm not messing around. I'm using Strength. Kill this ass. Are you battling a trainer? Uh, yeah. Aw, oh, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're, Wait. you're a little ahead of me, but that's all right. 90, um, 85, 90. Oh, damn. Us, uh, Pug wants to learn takedown, but it has the same stats as Rock Climb, so uh, yeah, I'm not going to do that. I was starting to feel a little disappointed. It's like, ah, crap. Mm -hmm. Takedown would have been so good. I was like, oh, it's the same as Rock Climb. Yeah, uh, forget that. Where's the patch of grass for 217? Uh, like, just before... Uh, it's on, like, to the right... Like, just before you go to the main area. Ah, damn it, McCarnivinus. Okay, I really gotta... I really gotta pick up the pace. Um, I need to get my... What do you mean? You're ahead of me. Well, I need to get my encounter, and then I gotta... Oh, here it is. And then I gotta get to Snowpoint. Uh, okay! Point. Okay! I'll take it! I might, I might finally have a, an electric type on this team. What is it? Uh, it's a Magnetric. So I'm fighting Latias. <laughs> <laughs> the transition from it's a Magnetric to I'm fighting a Latias. That was hilarious. Oh yeah, uh, if I didn't mention this, I probably didn't mention this uh, in the in the last episode when it happened. But I also lost the Plusle too. So yeah, that was nice. I probably I probably mentioned it in post or something. Sorry, I was so focused Damn. on the battle. That did not work at all. Mirko. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna swap. <sighs> Whiskers, you come out. Just to make this a little easier. Alright, I'm gonna start throwing some Pokeballs. Uh, the Quick Ball didn't work, if I didn't make that clear. Uh, Ultra Ball. You should work fine. Ah, oh, almost. Damn. What does a net ball do again? Oh yeah, water and bug type. That's like water and bug. <sighs> if I could get this manetric. Weevil. Evil weevil. Ah, huh. oh, damn it! It's getting there. This hail is gonna kill it if I'm not careful, though. Please let it die. <laughs> 
You're so mean. I'm just Why is honest. an Ultra Ball not working when a great... Alright, you know what? I'm telling you, Great Ball is better. It just... I don't know why, it just acts better. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Son of a bitch. Somewhere. <laughs> Arr, I really got this is oh my God. really I'm pissing me off. Fight. I'm fighting Snorlax now. Okay. So we got Slacking and... And, uh, and he's asleep. Okay. Uh, Slack King versus Snorlax. The two behemoths going at it. <sighs> God damn it. Okay. And what do you know? I'm infatuated by love. Please hit it. Yes! This is my last chance to catch it. Now. Oh! It's still alive! I still have one more chance! What do I use, though? I don't know. Uh, the runaway option? <laughs> yeah, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Huh? You'd like that, wouldn't you? Manetric's good, dude. Manetric is good. I mean, like, don't even go. It's, I, it's, again, I still have something for I have a couple of mods for him. I gotta go heal again, dude. These I hate this me, randomizer. <laughs> Come on, get in the bed. Thank you. All right, well, we're at about 30 minutes. You got the encounter. I still have it. I had to keep going to heal because everything I fight is freaking power. Um, <gasps> Wait a minute. There's one more encounter I can get. The lake. Damn, you're going to be two encounters ahead of me. Lake, Where at? There's a lake encounter. Uh, lake, lakefront encounter. Yeah, no, but I sprayed a, this. I sprayed a repel though, so I gotta wait for this stupid thing to wear off. I'm gonna go to, I'm gonna go to Snow Point first, and then it'll uh, heal up my Pokemon, and then, I'm... dude, 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 if I can get a, better be a damn good mon. I'm still trying to get through the snow. I'll come back and fight these trainers. I'm not gonna not fight these trainers. Come on, Repel. I need you to wear off. What a There's stroke of luck. Electrizer. Okay. All right. Here's my oh, encounter. Oh, that's a fortress. Do I even want that? Fortress. Fortress. That... Where's the rock climb, by the way? Uh, more to the left. Seeing a single thing, Tom. Okay, like I'm. I went all the way, I, I went all the way to the left. Well, the house is like all but the way to the left, and that's in that really, 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 really snowy area. Well, this sucks. Now I gotta go adventure. <laughs> oh wait, Fortress is part bug, nice. isn't he? I'm trying to remember the, the the thing that can explode. Yeah. Bug and steel. Yes, I can use a net ball on it, and it would work. Got it! Alright. Not the best catch I could have asked for, but I'll take it. I'm gonna I will say this, Fortress is up there as one of my most hated Pokemon too. I can't stand Fortress. Stupid. It's literally stupid. I don't I don't understand what I'm missing. Cause I don't want to take a chance of having to go die, and I'm sitting here fighting all these trainers. I don't even want to fight them, but I'm walking around. Oh. Uh, give me a second, I just need to check something. Guess what I just found? A grump pig. What am I gonna do this damn thing? Is that your encounter? No, hell no. I'd run away. <laughs> Alright. I can't find no grump pig. Screw grump pig. So I'm gonna I'm gonna call this uh, fortress explosion. Because of course. Does it have explosion though? I don't know. I didn't it didn't use explosion the entire time I was there, and I was there for like Quite a while. Okay. One of my encounters could have been a Weeping Bell. Honestly, I think Fortress would have been better than a Weeping Bell. 
Um, but yeah, I gotta go. I'm gonna go check uh, my Pokemon and uh, see what it is capable of. Yeah, you're you're quite a ways ahead, so. Please be something good. Like, I lost the Magnetric. I can't. I can't get an Electric type to save my life. And anytime I do, they're weak ass Mons that just end up dead. Alright. Whoa! Okay, well it's gonna evolve into Gyarados, so this so this ability probably won't even matter. Actually, if it had this ability. Uh this Magikarp has Levitate. Interesting. Yeah, but it's not well A, it's not gonna matter it's gonna change once it evolves, and B, even if it keeps that ability, it's useless because it's already part flying. Yep. Um Alright. Ah, my fortress has keen eye. It prevents the Pokemon from losing accuracy. That's nice. It does have explosion! Wow, I am so glad it didn't use it. So you could send that in. I could send use it an in. an explosion and to get rid of something of mine. I could. And it can't, but you lose- I get the point! Yes, yeah, that- yeah, then so- you, you would have to win the last one. Yes, so, for those of you guys that are- so- that- ah, uh, I can't talk. So for everyone that doesn't know, what we agreed on is if you use Explosion or Destiny Bond or anything that could potentially uh, kill the other team's Pokemon, whoever used that particular move does not get the point. Yeah, so if I use, say, like he sends out the Fortress, right, and I sent out, I don't know, Suicune, right, and he does Explosion, we're, and if we both die... We, we both lose the mod, but I would get the point because he was throwing it away. Mm -hmm. But he's doing it so he can get rid of my Pokemon. I just got the Icicle Plate. And, uh, <laughs> what do you know? Another plate. And, uh, and that's how it works and vice versa. So, like, say, I'm trying to, uh, my Electrode. I do have an Electrode. If, if I use Self Destruct and it kills the other mod, he, Tom would get the point. But say if he sent out his Gramble and it killed the Gramble, he would not be able to use the Gramble anymore. Yes. And do you want to tell them about the Revive? Yes. Uh, okay. So, what we've, um, so the rule that we came to the agreement on uh, is that the revive does not work uh, if you send them in the cage lock. So if I send in Granville and it dies, I cannot use the revive to bring it back. That only applies to the Nuzlocke. Time out. Time out. Uh, is this thick snow a new encounter, right? In the grass? Yes. So where it's by the icy rock? Yes. So, okay. Um, yeah, so I'm just, uh... Slow! Ho -ho! Woo! Okay. What? Interesting. Do I even want to know? It's a slow, bro. Okay. Psychic. Interesting. I'm very happy with this, actually. Mm. And I caught it on the first ball. Let's go. Alright, uh, so I'm pretty much ready to wrap up if, uh, we're at the, um, if we're at the particular mark. Yeah, we're at 37 minutes. I can, I'm gonna name this just, um, what do I wanna name Slowbro after? Slow. Um, Zach. His name's Zach. His name is Zach. <laughs> uh. So I would have one more encounter if I can get in the next episode. Okay, cool. I uh, I just saved, right. so um, saving too. Okay, so then I guess we just wrap up then. Yep. All right. So this is without further ado, go ahead and wrap it up. Yeah, I was about to say this is my episode. Um, yep. All right, guys. Um, thank you so much for watching this episode. Uh, we got two okay mons i would have liked the magnetric i want an electric type so i can have that electric type covering it's just ugh, it pisses me off to no end but we're not out of it yet um and we got another uh gym and potential cage match to get into in the next episode so be on the lookout for that but uh mm. on that note that is going to do it for this episode of uh, Pokemon Diamond Randomizer Cage Lock. If you'd like a Pokemon nickname after you, let us know in the comments below. Um, but do you have anything else you want to say, Houdini? 
no, I think I'm okay, man. Uh, I had a pretty good episode. None of us lost any Pokemon, so that was pretty good. That was so, well. And we had some pretty decent encounters, so. Yeah. Still would have liked the main metric, but anyways. Uh, I am Tom Leo. It's your boy Houdini. And we are signing off. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace. See ya.